second generation girl group member announces her new fiance right after concluding her first marriage. She has found a new beau. Former TRA's Ariam announced her divorce through social media on December 10, 2023. In a shocking twist, she also announced that she would be remarrying as soon as the divorce was official. Ariam previously married businessman Kim Young Gol in 2019. Through her social media, she explained that she was still in the midst of a divorce, but had met a precious new person. I've found someone who makes me always want to be next to him. I didn't want to make his presence known because he is so precious. The love that started as if we were surrounded by auroras has become so true that after thinking about it, we have decided to make it known proudly. He taught me what happiness was as I was tired by so many things, but somehow maybe he was someone who was in more pain than I was. He was the only one who ran to help me without knowing if he would be harmed in the process. He is someone who fills my once painful dreams with hope and flutters and is bearing many things to help make my dreams come true. I've really met someone who is so precious and is someone I am grateful for. Although I've been plagued by rude words to the end, I think that as long as I can stand proud, everything is fine. Although I've continued to be tortured and they even suggested coming to a compromise, even that has been postponed. But because someone I love is protecting me, I will not give up, and I am trying my best to enjoy life. I am also making the effort to make things up with good memories with my child. Thinking about it again, I'm really grateful. I'm searching for happiness with this person, and through true love, I am overcoming these painful times. Arium. She also clarified that she had not been cheating on her ex-husband. They had been divorced in name, but not on paper for a long time. The definition of cheating is when someone loves two people at the same time. I gave birth to my second child alone, and I've lived a miserable life. I've been holding on barely, thinking about my children. I want to enjoy my life now. In the future, I'll be dealing with malicious comments and guesses strictly. You're free to think whatever you want to, but please remember that if you speak those thoughts out, you can be punished. I hope you make good decisions. I hope you will only leave comments of hope and support. We will register our marriage as soon as the divorce lawsuit is over, and we have already promised to marry each other. We will achieve our dreams together coolly, and have promised to set up the Arium Foundation to help many children. As he didn't sign the papers, we've been divorced for a few years already, just that it wasn't legally sealed. I don't think I need to say more. There's also no need to slander him, or write childish posts about him. I don't even want to think about it. I don't want to be tangled up in messy punishments for slander so I'm just going to bury it. So I don't even want to think about attacking him. I'm going to think of only the good things and forget about the painful things. We are standing above a train track with no final stop and plan on walking the path of happiness. We will continue to love each other until you share our happiness. And it doesn't matter if there are talks about precedence. The future is what is important, so you don't have to worry about it. The haters who don't know the situation will be punished legally. Thank you for the support and love. We will give you our love. Arium. The news does not come as a surprise. On reality show Between Marriage and Divorce, she once made it publicly known that she was contemplating a divorce.